number 224 in the imprint range from 1962 is The Spiral Road, a movie that I have never heard of before, I've never stumbled across before and I don't know why because it's got some great big stars in it and it's a phenomenally interesting and very different film, especially in the time it came out. You, you've got Rock Hudson, uh, Burl Ives, uh, you've got Gina Rowlands, it's a great cast and here we have Dr. Drager who after qualifying has to go and work uh, in this place for five years as part of a government contract that he's signed. When he gets there there's all kinds of assignments he can get but he wants to go and work with Dr. Janssen played by uh, Ives who is a kind of reclusive man who was doing some amazing work on leprosy hasn't really had much published in the past few years and is almost kind of vanished and we follow our eager young doctor as he travels into this jungle apocalyptic world almost traveling upriver to meet dr jansen dr jansen who did you expect robinson crusoe and when he gets there he discovers a strange world of customs and people that he doesn't know as he tries to um, become almost familiar with the language, with the people, with the practices as he sees Dr Janssen in the way he freely moves around these people as he does what he has to do and as he guzzles gin by the barrel load What is that doctor? They didn't tell me <coughs> Gin Gin PG, pure gin It's one of those movies that every time I thought I know where this is going it would take a left turn into something far different, far darker or comedic or a small break for a romance or into something uh, much darker and it was great to see that, to see the relationships and, and how they were formed, how they would fall apart, how they would rebuild throughout, it was terrific because we have several relationships here. Mrs. Anton Drager, we were married last night. And I'm happy to say that this woman is thriving on your climate. We have our main character, Dr. Drager, who so desperately wants to work with Janssen, who gets his wish, who is fulfilling his career, he's passionate in it and it feels rewarding. His relationship with his fiancée, how that damages the relationship between the two doctors. All of these relationships are very impactful and keep me super interested to this one but it's the world that we are in, this treacherous, dangerous world where they're there trying to help these people which could ultimately destroy them as well because there's so much disease going on here. So many things that they have to do that you can't come away with a clean conscience of the things that they're doing in this and even at the end as we see our character almost driven to madness I'll kill you I'll kill you I'll kill you with some fun sequences involving a witch doctor which are just truly a terrific haunting scary um, gets to the, the core of anxiety almost as you see this character worked up into a frenzy the isolation the barrage of noise the constant taunting how it just wears down this character it's terrific i really enjoyed the spiral road I and mean, i think it's a movie that more people should have heard of because it's incredibly fun um, and one that i would definitely recommend let's dive into the extras and have a little look at what's on the disc for The Spiral Road. Here we are in the disc for The Spiral Road. Let's go to special features. You'll see there's an audio commentary by Daniel Kremer and David DelVal. And we have Kim Newman on Rock Hudson, which is 17 minutes, 30 seconds. And Kim Newman packs a lot of information into that time about Rock Hudson. And it was, again, fascinating to listen to. So there we have it, Spiral Road, I would highly recommend this one, terrific stuff, um, a film that feels as if it could have inspired multiple different films, it touches in various different genres and is really worthwhile. I'd love to know your thoughts on the Spiral Road if you've seen it, so let me know in the comment box below whether you loved it, hated it, fell somewhere in the middle, I'm just curious. And there is more content up here if you want to see more of my stuff. In the description box below are links to the Patreon membership program 
mandyfilm.com. Always, in which you can support me. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.